sound cheesy, but simply getting out of the apartment and moving around outside, whether it be walking, bicycling, or any other method, just makes me feel so much better. If I'm in a bad mood, it pulls me out of it right away. If I'm feeling good, it makes me feel even better and gives me an inner joy that transcends to just about every aspect of my life. Today was a special day because I got to do just that in a way that cleans up the city and the environment. A few weeks ago, I booked a green kayak for Axel and I to paddle around the harbors and lakes of Copenhagen. Green Kayak is an environmental NGO with the aim to reduce the amount of waste in our waters. The idea is simple get a free green kayak trip in return for collecting trash and sharing this on social media. I've always felt that the best way to see Copenhagen is from the water. Today's adventure took us to one of Copenhagen's man-made lakes called Peblinge Sø, or Student Lake. As I booked this in advance, we got really lucky because it was a beautiful day on the lake today. We got to pedal next to ducks, herons, and swans, both living and used for paddle boats. And I just learned that the swan is the national bird of Denmark since the 1980s, so my last name being Swanson, I feel like I fit right in here. So with the goal of this kayak tour to be to pick up trash from the harbors, the hunt was going pretty well. Uh, we started off with a bicycle chain lock, which was pretty heavy. Woo! First find of the day. That's great. This was a pretty big find for us today because all of the trash that we collect on the trip is weighed and counted, but I'll get back to that in a little bit. <laughs> we paddled around the sides of the lake today collecting what seemed to be endless beer bottles, beer cans, wine bottles, and various types of garbage. Things were going fine at this rate, but the big scores came when we got close to the main street on one of the corners of the lake. We found a few pieces of metal construction equipment, but they were too heavy to actually bring them all in the boat, so we were able to bring one and we had to leave the rest. Probably the biggest find of the day was a large orange construction cone. Okay. I think we just collected the biggest haul that us or maybe anybody else has gotten on one of these trips. It's a construction cone. <laughs> this thing was so heavy to get into the water. We ended up with so much stuff on our boat that we had to stop collecting trash about halfway through. But the nice part was that we just got to paddle around and really enjoy our time on the water today. So once we were finished, we brought everything back up to the office, and as it turns out, the total amount of trash that we collected was 43 kilos. This set the new record for trash at this location, but, you know, the real winners are the city and the environment, but we still set the record, which is pretty cool, too. So that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for going on this adventure with me, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.